Hi guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. So today we'll be unboxing this 27 inch LG Ultra Gear 27GN 750 gaming monitor. This is an IPS with 240Hz and this is actually one of the best gaming monitors that I've seen out there. And well, it's an LG brand. So let's get started. So now we're going to start from the top. Okay. Okay, so this is the outside box. It actually looks pretty impressive because normally gaming monitors, they are very basic, you know, and when I got my 24 inch Samsung monitor, which I'll put a link in below, it was very basic, but from this box, it looks very impressive already. So, a well done by LG. So now let's see the contents that is inside this box. Let's go. First thing we all see is the stand, I suppose. Okay, it's already a metal stand. It's actually quite solid because it's PV, yeah. And then this will be the back part of the monitor that will hold up everything. And this will be all the wires as well as the adapters to the monitor. And now we actually come to the monitor itself. So it's very thin. This is actually the monitor. It's a uh, 27 inch as well as it's matte to reduce any uh, reflection from light and so far it looks pretty good and it also comes with NVIDIA G-Sync. So let's move the box out of the way and let's see what else we can fix it up with. Okay, so now we're gonna fix everything up and then we'll show you what the monitor will look like when everything has been set up, okay? All right. Hi guys, so now actually the monitor is just set up. I just set up, it's a very simple pro process. I am so glad LG Malaysia did it so simple because when I set up my Samsung one, it took me about 15 minutes plus, you know, but this one was so simple. No screws, nothing, you just have to clip everything on. So LG, you did a good job on making this simple for customers to actually fix it up and get to work with it. Because it just took us about 10 minutes only, it's that simple. Take out everything from the box, you clip everything together and done. So just using it for a while, I'm actually impressed because actually my graphic card cannot handle too much, okay? So when I play games also, it's also kept at a certain hertz. But this monitor impressively can actually go up to 240 hertz, alright? So, it's super impressive. I just gotta say that because 240 hertz is really crazy, okay? And then this is also a FHD display with IPS and it also has NVIDIA G-Sync. So there'll be a sticker here at the side of the monitor and it says NVIDIA G-Sync, okay? As well as this is borderless gaming monitor. It says that on the website. But if you talk about the border, right? Actually, this laptop, this monitor's border is actually thicker than my Samsung's border. Okay, as you can see here, the border is about like I would say a 0 0.5 cm. It's about like that. Okay, it's not very uh, obvious, but it's still there. It's noticeable lah, within a close distance. Okay, but I'm actually impressed with this monitor so far. As well as I think it uses some kind of hydraulic system. You know why? Just by pushing it down or up, feels super like you know like your office chair where you can go up and down. It just feels like that. It's super light and super easy to move. So I'm actually impressed with that. As well as you can tilt it front and back. That is not normal until you see this, okay? This monitor can also be tilted this way. There we go. Okay? So it's a bit scary to do that at first because I never knew this monitor was able to do that until I actually checked out the manual and all that. So there you go. As you can see, now it's literally vertical, okay? So this is set up mainly for gaming. So I can literally have three monitors, maybe my 
maybe if I have a desktop, I can have these three of these kind of monitors set up like that and all of them sync together. So, wow, I'm really, I'm really, really impressed by this. But the thing is, the price is also very impressive. It's 1,500 ringgit, okay? So this is nothing cheap for a monitor. This is actually a proper premium and expensive monitor, okay? And this uh, LG has been awarded the gaming design monitor brand in the US. So it's number one. And I have one of them right in front of me here. Okay, so this innovation is beyond boundaries. Okay, this one is really, really good. I'm very impressed with LG. It has an IPS of 1 MS. Okay, uh, it's incredible speed. Okay, it's really incredible, the speed. And it also has something called fluid gaming motion because of its 240 hertz refresh rate. Okay, so this refresh rate is really crazy. It's no more 60, it's no more 140, it's now 240 hertz. I have been using on my com my laptop is only 60 hertz. Then I had a gaming monitor which was a quite a basic one. I would say like an entry level. It's a 75 hertz. And now in front of me here is a 240. Hertz uh, refresh rate monitor, so that is really a big uh, difference. Okay, this IPS is also uh, sRGB 99%. Okay, so we can actually feel the color. Okay, we can actually feel the colors when we game because the colors are so real, so vivid, so bright, so much contrast. Everything is just good about it. Okay, the colors are really impressive. But before I continue, let me just tilt this back. Okay. And it's also very simple. I can do it with almost one hand. Look at that. Okay, but I don't suggest you to do that. It's best you do it with two hands for better grip. Okay, so there. Yeah, now the screen is back. You can use it like a normal one. But if you have a few screens here, that'll be crazy. Okay, that'll be the best. I would really love to see that in action. Okay, then we go next to the Nvidia G Sync compatible. Okay, so actually, my laptop is able to have this function with this monitor so it's very good so it actually uh, minimizing stutter as well uh, it gives a smoother and faster gaming experience so LG worldwide has done this monitor to be the best I think in the world okay this I think it could be the best budget gaming monitor because you pay to uh, 1500 ringgit here in Malaysia and you get a very very good mainly specific for gaming okay because LG2 sells another monitor that is 38 inch, it's called the ultra wide 38 inch monitor. That is very good, but uh, the only thing downside is it's a 144 hertz refresh rate. But other than that, it's super because that monitor is super big, super like when you put it on the table, it just looks super cool, okay? And then it also comes with QHD plus. This is only an FHD, so imagine we go up next level QHD and then they have a something called plus by LG. So it just tops the level up, but that price is almost about 2k or even 2.5. I'm not too sure about that price, okay? And then it also comes with AMD FreeSync. As I told you, my my own monitor, the older one, has this function, and I too can see the difference. So we don't have like the starters and where we see like it's very unclear and blur. This is super clear, it's super smooth and super fast due to the free sync that is on this by AMD, and this is the premium free sync version okay and the hdr is hdr 10 really guys this thing this monitor is really impressive there's like so much things to talk about it okay it has a greater clarity as well it's more realistic okay because of its colors its colors are super rich like i can see from the difference of my monitor and this monitor like the colors here are very very <laughs> very real you know the colors here are very real it's very good but it cannot be the LG's OLED screen lah. That's just gotta say about that. Okay, but this one is actually very impressive, really, no doubt. Okay, but if you are thinking it's gonna be like a 4K, 8, 8K kind of display, no, no, no. This is only uh, FHD. Okay, but the colors is itself is already very good and very mesmerizing with it. Okay, as well as uh, uh, the darkness, uh, it has a black stabilizer. Okay, what that means is. Like for the darker areas, I'm not sure how it does it, but it's super intelligent. It has maybe like a chip behind it that processes the image here. And for, for those darker colors, uh, it will actually make it brighter and more. 
it has more contrast so we can actually read or we can see the thing better okay or not it would actually look very bland but the the thing is this one is possible to make it look bright and very vivid and actually just make your gaming experience totally cooler and then we also have come something called cross cross hair is a feature that brings an accuracy advantage okay so this will also help you in your gaming because for those gamers you have to shoot shoot and all that right so you can actually it actually helps because it makes the display more clear it, it makes it uh, it helps you look at the enemies that you're going to attack much better okay and next we also have a complete battle station okay you know why this thing is really a complete thing you just have to buy this monitor and that's it you're done with it. you don't need to go around finding the cables that suited with your laptop nothing because it comes everything with it literally they gave us three cables this one here one here and one i'm actually connecting it to my uh, laptop right now i'm not sure it's able to work with thunderbolt 4 but it does work with thunderbolt 3 that's for sure so it's quite a sad thing it can't work with thunderbolt 4 because uh, newer laptops nowadays as well as my laptop which is actually just a normal laptop it's not a gaming laptop nothing i'll put the link in the description for my laptop it's now a gaming laptop but it has thunderbolt 4 so i just wish this gaming monitor does have it because with Thunderbolt 4 and you just buy that deck or that dock, it'll be so simple. Everything just plug into one and it works with one port only that goes into the laptop. So it makes your gaming setup much clear, cleaner and much better because you don't have wires and all that going around, okay? So that's really very good with this monitor because it helps you with all of that. So I'm actually very impressed with what LG has made but I feel that the price 1005 here is a bit too expensive here in Malaysia so LG should find a way to reduce the price because I'm a bit disappointed it does not come with QHD okay I wish it come with QHD or maybe even a 4K display but sadly it's only an FHD but other than that I'm still very proud of this monitor it's really very good and well done to LG okay in you guys have done an amazing job on this that's all i gotta say all right so maybe let me let me show you guys some kind of gaming on this monitor all right but i just want to let you know i'm using an mx450 that's hooked up to this monitor so it will not be the best okay because my graphic card cannot compete with what this uh this monitor is actually capable of okay so it's a bit disappointing for me but Maybe who knows, I might just upgrade to a better gaming setup next time. Maybe I'm having an RTX. So now I'll show you some kind of gaming on this monitor. So let's go. Okay, so now we are actually opening up a game on Roblox that I actually play. So this is a game called Outbreak Tycoon. This game was created by my friend as well as I did some programming in this game, okay? Especially the cars in this game. You guys can go and check the cars out in this game. I'll put the link in the description, okay? This game is now needs your support, alright guys? It did well before and now it needs your support. So please, if those that play Roblox, please recommend them this game so that they can enjoy this Tycoon game as well. So now I just loaded up Outbreak Tycoon, okay? On this... Uh, 27 inch monitor i'm just gonna let you guys see from here because i can't really move this too much you know because it's a bit heavy as well and i'm a bit too worried because it's a thousand five ringgit monitor so i don't want to break it nothing okay so you just guys in the cc this is actually my own uh, tycoon all right so from here i can't see much like difference because as i told you my uh, laptop cannot handle as what this monitor is capable of but from now i see that the colors are very good that's one major thing i've noticed okay the colors are much better than the one on my monitor as well as the screen is much bigger so that is actually a big improvement to be honest and i can actually lower it down and then with my monitor just by the side of it now it's a major difference because of the color mainly okay only thing i can see from here is the color the color is really good other than that the, the sinking and all those uh, refresh rate is actually nothing much from what I can see but mainly is color. I know LG does an amazing job with colors. They do very well for their TVs as well as their monitors. That's why I'm really proud to have another LG brand in my house because we already have four LG products and now we bring one more into the family. 
I hope to be collecting more LG products. So I think that's all from this video guys. I am really proud and happy to have this LG Ultra Gear Monitor. It also comes with 3 years warranty so I do not need to worry about that. LG will cover everything except if I break it by myself, okay? And yeah, that's basically it guys. You have nothing else to worry. Just buy this monitor. If you guys have the budget, just get it. Use it. Let me know for those that actually bought this monitor already. Let me know in the comments below. I want to know what are your guys' experience, okay? I'm truly hyped about this. You can see, I'm like so happy about this monitor. But that's all. That's all I got to say guys, alright? Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, please like, and please comment down ideas so that I can continue making the contents that you guys like, okay? And give me your ideas so I can make and do something that you guys like. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Hope to see all of you here, all of you there with a big smile on my next video, okay? Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more videos and see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.